Good day, all you wonderful people. Welcome to Adventure Together. My name's Al. Trail name, look out. And today I am walking towards Helena. There's a cutoff because there's a fuel mitigation project where I don't know what they're doing, but they're digging up trees and making a road or something like that. So the red line, the main line of CDT proper, is closed in about 25 miles from where I am now there is a line that goes around it actually there's several several options to go around it so I'm heading up towards one that is yellow I'm going to show you a little shot a screenshot now so you can see what I mean and uh, you can see looking at this map you've got yellow going to the east then you've got like a purple one and then like a burgundy I don't know but uh, there are a few routes around it I'm just going to go to the yellow and then go to Helena so I'm going to do 35 miles today and then tomorrow do another 10 yeah that's the plan for today Well, ladies and gentlemen, I've just finished lunch. Luckily, I'd finished. Didn't get interrupted this time, but the storm for the afternoon has started. Now I can't wait to not be trapped in a thunderstorm every single afternoon. So glad they use Comic Sans there. There's a reroute in place. Road walk time. So here we are at the diversion, ladies and gentlemen. The red line goes up that hill. The yellow line goes over that way. And the purple line goes through those trees up there. And I... I'm um, an expert tent spot finder and I thought you know what it's Friday night these boys aren't working tomorrow morning and here's a lovely little flat spot that they've cleared out right next to their vehicles so seeing as the wind is coming from this direction and going that way I'm gonna park my stuff next to this truck and This one's not going anywhere. This one can protect me from the wind tonight when I uh, put my tent right there. Nice and flat and level. There we go. Solidly set up, ready for a night. And uh, there's a little cabinet on the side of the truck. And I was thinking about chucking my earth sack and all that stuff in there. But uh, when I opened it up, it was absolutely full of grease and oil and it looks like everything inside is stained with thick layer of grease so yeah it won't be going in there but it was an idea to chuck all my smelly stuff in there and bears wouldn't get at it guess it's just living in the tent with me grizzly area changed nothing about the way I store my food I'm only joking tried to get into that fella over there but uh that one was locked up too so yeah nothing uh, really that I can do to keep it safe because the lack of trees around here there are a load of trees as you can see but they're all like tiny little 
ones and dead ones and stuff so it's not too secure oh. we'll find some way of storing it whether i throw it on the roof there or something like that bury it there's a whole load of hardcore over there i can just bury it well ladies and gentlemen it's the next day and uh welcome to the breakfast kitchen we're on the back of the truck here and uh i didn't want to cook anything this morning i don't know i just didn't feel like heating anything up so i'm just going to using the last of my wraps and putting peanut butter on to use up the last of the peanut butter so that's it appetizing but also dry as this dirt yesterday really wasn't a sort of beautiful stunning day all the views i saw which were probably two two viewpoints um yeah they weren't that pretty they weren't worth recording in my opinion and the rest of the day was green tunnel up and down up and down rocky or just in trees so it really wasn't a uh, a beautiful day with anything remarkable to to say to 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 its name really and uh so that's why we ended up with such a short vlog but now today in uh the next vlog for yourself and the next couple of hours for me i'm going to be walking towards helena the capital of montana and uh, i'm going to be getting a hitch in from the highway hopefully uh michigan is illegal to hitch the same as Idaho, but uh maybe i'll I'll get away with it and uh, can get in. I plan to stay at a hotel on my own, go to Walmart, resupply and uh, get out again. So um, yeah, we'll, uh, we'll see that in tomorrow's vlog. And uh, yeah, Monday morning, today is uh, Sunday, to Monday morning, I'm going to be heading back to trail. So yeah, busy old time, try and get everything done. The logistics of this trail aren't uh, aren't uh, you know given up even at the last minute. I'm uh, still having to organise boxes to go to East Glacier, which is the last resupply point. And uh, it isn't really a resupply point; it's the last place I'm going to be sending a box. <laughs> so this is the uh, the last major resupply point. Um, it has a Walmart, so that's what I'm going to use to. Uh, to do all of the the shopping for this trip uh, up to Lincoln where I'm going to collect a box and for the box that's going to go to East Glacier but uh, for now I guess that's all I have for this vlog please if you haven't already donated then um, I assume that uh, you're waiting for me to finish this this uh, trek I hope by the time that this vlog comes out you know that I will have already finished the trail so hopefully you can get those donations going in for wilderness foundation uk we're trying to raise three thousand one hundred pounds for people who really really need it taking kids and vulnerable adults and out of the city and into nature for therapy and uh, climate change mitigation projects it's all a worthwhile cause and uh well thank you for joining me and i'll see you in the next one